All right, what's up, YouTube? Uh, this is Jonathan coming here uh, with another video from JPlay's Keys. Obviously, you don't see any keys in the video. That is because, uh, yeah, I don't know why, but I'm working on some errands and some stuff around the house today. And I decided to, while I was sitting here at my office, just go ahead and go live and talk to the community if we get anybody to join. So anyway, that's what I'm doing here today. A um, little update on channel, I could say. We, we've had some really good success. We're quickly approaching 10,000 subscribers on J Plays Keys. So that's pretty amazing. When I started this uh, two or three years ago in my apartment, I didn't think about 10,000 people. I was anxiously waiting the day that any one of my videos would get 100 views. And now I can get 100 views probably in the first hour or two of uh, posting a video, which is really good. It's a blessing. And I'm glad that you know we're able to help so many people learn how to play some of the most popular gospel songs um, that are out at the moment and really the goal of jay plays keys is to empower more musicians to play competently at church you know uh, i know we have there's events there's playing for yourself there's playing at weddings and all that good stuff our goal of jay plays keys is you know if all that happens for you great but we really want to help churches who may not be able to afford you know a high price musician or you might want to grow up a musician in your own community. That's who that, that's who we want to who we want to help. So, um, yeah. So that's who we want to help. So if you're a part of a church, you just want to learn how to play the piano. You can do that with J Plays Keys. If you've already got a little bit of the beginner skills, you can look at the videos that I post, and you can learn how to play some pretty cool songs. What's next? Um, there have been a couple requests that I get to do some things that are for like straight up beginners in piano and basically take someone that doesn't have the basic skills. Because if you watch my videos, you know, you got to know already how to play the piano, um, not at a high level, but you got to already be a beginner to learn how to play the songs the way I teach them. I haven't really taught them from a, you know, straight beginner, uh, uh, from a straight beginner context. So. I've been thinking about that a lot, and the thing is that it, it it it's difficult to teach beginner piano and show you how to play songs at the same time because some songs are just complex. So what I'm thinking about doing is just making a lesson or video series or something like that just for a person that does not know how to play the piano. So maybe you are a person who is just now you know, finding out that you have an interest in the piano, maybe you played 10 years ago and you forgot everything, man, this would pretty much show you how to play, you know, say the key of C and play a scale and play the basic chords and try to get you up to that level where you're able to follow um, my beginner to intermediate uh, piano videos. So um, I definitely understand that and I know what it's like to look at someone play an instrument and say, man, I wish I could do something with that. I do that with uh, when I see people play the guitar. I'm like, I would love to be able to play that instrument the way they play, but I just can't because I don't understand the guitar, right? So uh, I want to help people be able to do that. So that's something that's coming up for J Plays Keys. Let's see what we got going on here. Okay. All right, yeah, so that's what's going on in J Plays Keys. I believe that we'll also be working on some other things as well. I want to change the the kind of model that J Plays Keys is going. So right now we're focusing a lot on videos, just how many videos can I produce and you know get all the songs up, people learn how to play songs. That's good, but I think I want to do something else. I think I want to show more skills. And if you have the skills, you can learn how to play, you know, the songs. So maybe this is how you play by ear. That's another uh, request that I've been getting. And, you know, um, it, it's hard because, like, I play like it's like if you say, hey, teach me how to walk. 
right? It's something that you do every day. And at some point you had to learn how to do it, but man, if I had to teach someone how to do it, it's kind of hard. So I've been taking some time thinking about what is, what do I do when I hear someone play a song or sing a song and I want to play it? And so I don't know that I'll answer that question anytime soon, but I hear you. I hear the requests. I will work on that. I can't say it'll be <laughs> next week or next month, but you know, I know there's other guys out there that show you how to how to play by ear, but I believe also that everybody's got their own their own audience and their own voice. So, you know, you you might learn from Jermaine Griggs or Jamal Hartwell or uh, C Dub over at Piano Clubhouse, but you might want to hear how Jay Plays Keys does it. So I understand that. Uh, I want to join. You know, those guys are way ahead of me and you know they they've shown a lot of people how to play stuff. So yeah, we'll we'll get there, you know. It's coming. Mm. Yes, in 